Good morning, Ridge, and welcome back to another edition of Ridge Rush. I'm Adriana. And I'm Isabella. Here's what's happening around the Ridge and in the world on September 14th, 2022. With homecoming only three days away, we'd like to thank everyone who's dressed up today for Decades Day. What was your intro for today? The 60s. What about you? Mine was the 70s, kind of. Um, make sure to buy your tickets on My Payment Plus or at the front doors on Saturday, and we'd love to see all y'all there. 23-year-old Shania King was shot and killed in Baldwin County on Monday night, according to Baldwin County Sheriff's Office. Deputies responded to a call after the atrium health after she was brought into the hospital with a gunshot wound. Shania King was, her, was at her residency before Rico Stephan shot her and was then transported to a local hospital by Stephan, where she was later pronounced dead. Officers are still looking into what played out before the incident occurred, and Stephan is currently being held at the Baldwin County Detention Center without a bond. With more local news, a rapist and kidnapper is out in Duluth, Georgia. His real name is Tarek Mentori, but also uses the names Isaac Miller or Isaac Mann. He is currently living off Petrie Industrial by the Kroger with his mom and used to be a massage therapist in Tennessee where he would lure women, and, lure women and rape them. He is out on parole living in Duluth, Georgia, and has been walking around with a puppy in town green asking girls for their numbers in case they want to buy one. Duluth PD is aware of him but has... But as always, please be safe. Now here's Adriana with the weather. Today we'll see a high of 82 and a low of 57. Well, that is all the news we have for you today. I'm Adriana. And I'm Isabella. Have a great day, Ridge. And, and go, go Lions! Lions.